So we are here in Krakow, International Airport, waiting for Kaya and Charles to come. Poland. The plan is to go to my home city, Katowice, and do some street rails over there. Salmon Free Ski TV. Żeby mieć running. I prawie że skończone jest. Jest bardzo fajne i jestem bardzo zadowolona. It was really good. Really good Polish, seriously. Cops are super friendly and they told us that we can come back here at like 9 p.m. till 11 p.m. because they're changing the shift and nobody will come. Poland! Merrick introduced us to this local guy named Piotr Pinkus. Pinky! Pinky, right out of the gate, just blew us all away. Up that big uh, 16 kink, and it's gonna be a big challenge because it's pretty long and mellow. What? 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 You don't listen to. You speak English? Yeah. No? Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What's happening? What's going on? The update on the situation is that the guy who's in charge of this bridge and rail area is not pissed. He thinks it's actually pretty cool what we're doing, but Mr. Mustache, uh, security guard, ran a cop there, and he's pissed. So he's called the real cops, but our man Merrick's been put in some work to see if we can't uh, fandangle our way out of this. You guys king? No. No. Merrick was just laughing and joking with the cops, so we figured it was all good, but all of a sudden Charles is in the cop car. Gonna go to jail! Guess they needed to take him to the station as a formality just to go over his passport, uh, but he said they were the coolest cops he'd ever met because they were just laughing and joking around in the car with each other the whole time. of his ribs and he continued to ski hard the rest of the trip. Yeah, that was a good one. <laughs> I'm okay, I just, that hurt, dude. I'm over this rail. We're just packing, getting ready to go to Sacapana. Actually, I'm not packing. You're just sitting. <laughs> but it seems like it's all done, so I'm just hanging. <laughs> I'm staying in the back seat with two pros and they're both wearing their skull candy headphones. I guess the pros don't want to talk to me. They're just gonna listen to their headphones the whole way to Zach and Fanny, and that's fine. Right now we are in Zakopane, Polish biggest skiing resort. It's plus 10 degrees over here, so the conditions are really, really bad. So we rolled up to this rail and it was a beautiful rail. Boris showed up, he was about five foot five, had the meanest unibrow I've ever seen, and he was pissed. He was crazy pissed. Some fat f***ing Polish guy just lost his mind because we were desecrating his beautiful handrail. He called Kaya and I sheeps, which we laughed about. And then he called Kaya a laughing cow, which we didn't really laugh about. Oh, <laughs> cow, dude. But it is pretty funny. <laughs> we found this wall ride with the graffiti on it. It looked pretty gangsta. No snow. Like we are landing almost on concrete. We're all trying to do our best and having fun. And that's it. So we went up to the actual ski hill, skied down to the park, but we decided to pull the chute because the snow was so sticky and it was so windy, as you'll see with my stunning slow-mo hair shot. So we looked at all our options and decided. This shot's pretty cool because we stuck Steve in the fridge with a camera for the whole night. He was pretty cold. Charles had a pretty big itch to scratch and that itch had 16 kinks in it. 
We're on last day here in Poland. We went here at the beginning of the trip to do that 16 King, but we didn't get it because of city guard problem. So today we got a permission to eat it, so we'll have a whole day long, hopefully get it. Charles, again, proving how dedicated he is. Spent five hours hitting the rail with two crack ribs. I got a funny feeling that Charles will be coming back to that rail one day. Coming up on Solomon Free Ski TV, Mark Abma and Chris Rubens go to Chile to ski inside of a volcano. <laughs>